there's something that I fundamentally disagree with, and I'm going to be furious if it happens. If Brock Purdy wins the MVP this season, I'm going to be infuriated. I'm 100% with you on that. The idea that he is the engine behind that team is one that is feels intellectually dishonest if you are actually watching. You could argue best, quote unquote, to me, most versatile skill positions in the league. They can hit you any different types of ways, especially when you got Christian McCaffrey, who is like the cherry on the top. Christian McCaffrey is the racing stripe on the Ferrari instead of the engine. You know, like when you when he could operate in that capacity, that's how you end up getting 17 touchdowns in 13 weeks. But how can you have a guy who is in MVP consideration when someone else on his team has 17 touchdowns in 13 weeks? I'll take it a step further. You're talking about just in a league today. How about like since we've been watching football, like in our whole entire lives? I mean, you have Christian McCaffrey, you have Debo Samuel, Brandon Ayuk, who would be a number one on a lot of teams in the league, and George Kittle, who's probably your fourth option. Like, let, let that sink in. George Kittle is your fourth option. And we saw them when they didn't have Trent Williams and Debo for three weeks, and they went 0 and 3, right? 0 and 3. Mm -hmm. I mean, and accurate i'm just saying so yeah this is probably the most aligned we've been on a take that may be controversial like ever like, i couldn't agree with you more on this mm -hmm.